IBM Sanjus read a paper at the database workshop at the University of Ann Arbor, Michigan. This paper introduced the database language SQL, which was implemented by IBM in 1974 to 75 as a prototype language. SQL Exron and first attempt at the larger scale implementation of codes relational model was IBM's system R. This system used a revised version of the SQL called in 1977 system R became operational and SQL became SQL. System R was a success and relational ideas became accessible to general computer users. This was mainly due to the writings of C. J. Date from J. B. M. who in his book An Introduction to Database System provided a clear and uh, readable introduction. The seventh edition of this book was published in 2000 and is highly recommended to the reader as an excellent intermediate text on database management systems. At present, there are many implementations of the rational technology DB2, IBM Corporation, Oracle Corporation, Cybase, MSSQL, several or Microsoft, MS Access or MySQL, AB, Firebird, Interbase, PostgreSQL, etc. are some among them. Relational system are now available. All size and shapes of all the computers. RDBMS terminology. The relational model is an abstract theory of data that is based on the mathematical theory whose principles were laid down by Dr. E. F. Code. The relational model of code use certain themes and principles which were not familiar in the data processing circle at that time. The terms that were used to describe the database properties and functions lacked the precision necessary for the formal theory that code was proposing. So, a new set of terminology had to involve to the table. 18.1 gives a list of the rational terms and their corresponding informal equivalents. The rational deserve database management system, as said above, are based on the rational model, the rational relational model, in turn, in a way of looking at data, it is a prescription for how the represents and manipulate data more precisely. The relational model is concerned with three aspects of data data structure, data integrity and data manipulation. Relational data structure. The smallest unit of data in the relational model is the individual data value. Such values are assumed to be atomic which means that they have no internal structure. As far as the model is concerned, a domain is a set of all possible data values. For example, in a supplier parts relations, the domain of supplier numbers is the set of all valid supplier numbers. These domains are pools of values from which the actual values appearing in the attribute columns are drawn. The domain concept is a very important and integral part of the relation model because it has 
implications for comparisons and hence for the operations such as joints, unions, etc. that directly or indirectly involves such comparisons, joints and unions will be discussed in detail later but simply seeking both of them are method of combining data in more than one table. If two attributes draw their values from the same domain, one comparison evolving those two attributes makes sense because we are comparing like with like. Domains are conceptual in nature they may or may not be explicitly stored in a database as actual sets of values but they should be specified as part of database definition and then each attribute definition should include a reference to the corresponding domain now let us take a look at the relations the relation domains say d1 t2 and dn consists of a heading and a body. The re heading consists of a fixed set of distinct attributes say a1, a2 and an such that each attribute a1 corresponds to exactly one of the underlying domains d1. The body consists of a time varying set of tuples where each tuple in truth consists of the set of attributes value pair a1 v1 one such pair for each attribute a1 in the heading for any given attribute value pair is a value from the unique domain d1 that is associated with the attribute a1 we will explain this based on the following example let us see how the employee relation employee measures up with this definition the underlying domain r the domain of employee numbers say d1 the domain of employee names say d2 domain of employee age d3 and the domain of employee department names and the Heading of the employee table consists of attributes EMP, no, underlying domain D1, name, domain D2H, domain D3, and department domain D4. The body of employee table consists of a set of couple, and each couple consists of a set of four attribute value pairs. Uh, one such pair for each of the four attributes in the heading even though they are used uh, interchangeably a table and relation are not really the same thing for example the rows in a table have an opening that is from top to bottom similarly the columns from left to right but the tuples and attributes of a relation which are mathematical sets do not have any ordering. The number of attributes in a relation is called the degree of the relation. A relation of degree 1 is unary. A relation of degree 2 binary etc. So the employee relation has a degree of 4. The number of tuples or rows in a relation is called the cardinality of the relation. So the cardinality of the relation employee tables is 5. The cardinality of the relation changes with time as more and more tuple get added or deleted but the degree does not this illustrated in figure 18.5. One. The relation database management system and service is one of the main branches of the IT industry. 
where technological development were taking place at a very rapid pace.